What's up YouTube? Welcome back to my channel. I hope you enjoy your time while you're here. Today we have a fun guest. Would you like to introduce yourself? Hi, I'm Ruby, Katie's best friend. <laughs> <laughs> One off. Don't get, don't get too ambitious. No, yeah, this is Ruby. I live with her and she's one of my bestest friends in the whole world. Um, we are going to... Oh, I was just going to say Varsity, but no one knows what that is. I feel like Varsity is like a thing. Is it? I think other unis have it. I'm going to get some up. I thought it was just our thing. <laughs> so we're going to Varsity, which is like an event at the uni that we go to where we play our rival uni, which is Royal Holloway, at every sport that we both do. Um, Ruby does netball. I yeah. do cheerleading. It's a bit of a rivalry, but it's fine. Um, <laughs> I'm competing today, but Ruby's not playing because only our final year netball players play. So she's going to play next year. But I'm competing today, uh, but we're both going for the full day because it's like really long and like a million sports play. So we're going to do our makeup and get ready, and then you guys can watch us do that and enjoy it. <laughs> Please. <laughs> we hope. So we can get started. I will link all of the products that we use below because we're definitely going to forget to say things. But I'm starting with the Maybelline Face Studio Prime Illuminating Primer. Longest name for a primer ever. Prime, prime, prime. A million primes. You know, my yellow scrunchie on my hair. Oh, that's so cute. Our uni colours are blue and gold or yellow because <laughs> gold is a bit <laughs> hard to do. Depends. 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 So, um, because I'm competing with my love squad, we all have to have the same makeup, so I can't be very creative today. I just thought cool, that's a dig. Well, I mean, <laughs> come here. Oh, I'm sorry. Such a creative queen. Yeah, I'm such a creative queen. No, so I just have to do um, like a gold smoky eye and red lips. So that's what we're doing today. Yeah, just a bit basic. <laughs> Oh, I'm using the Benefit Cabral in shade 5. Um, I just plucked my eyebrows, so I'm feeling delicious. I look a bit. We love a fresh eyebrow. eyebrow. Well, that's not a word. We love a fresh eyebrow. I feel like it really transforms your whole yeah, it's really personality. <laughs> <laughs> Freshly plucked eyebrows are not a substitute for personality. <laughs> to be honest, they are. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a whole different person when I have the brow. I just used the Too Faced Born This Way foundation in porcelain. <laughs> Even though I fake tanned and it still matches me. <laughs> to be fair, it does not look like I would if I had porcelain that colour yeah. I'd be like, this is fake. Since you've never featured on my channel, this can be your moment to shine, and you can give us ten facts about yourself. Oh, brilliant! Ten. Cool. I can barely get like two. Um. So number one. <laughs> <laughs> so I can barely get you. Anyway, <laughs> back to me, Katie. This is mine, okay? Um. But why didn't you list ten facts about me? So oh, that's actually quite fun. Um. I, don't know, I, list ten facts about you. I can barely get two. Um. Ruby does adult nursing at uni. She's such a caring individual. What can I say? <laughs> Just fucking love <like> people. <laughs> um, she is from Ascot, which is very fancy. To be <laughs> She can do 10 Jaeger bombs in a row. And not bomb. And not bomb. <laughs> One of my proudest <laughs> achievements. It's like, oh, you're at uni? Yeah, but I could do 10 year goals in a row, so. <laughs> you're literally like, so what grade should you get? 10 year goals. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look, there's a little blue star. Well, I think that's from when um, Lou was here, and they're just all over my bedroom floor. <laughs> like, you know, when you get into bed and you have to like, wipe your feet because you haven't hoovered. Yeah. There's just all these like, little stars all over my feet. I'm like, oh, Lou. Ruby has the hottest showers ever known to man. We have, on our shower setting, it goes like from one to ten. 
Yeah, it turns out danger zone. <laughs> yeah. I have my shower on like five or six if I'm feeling extra cold. She has a shower on nine. Like if I put it more than a seven, it's like burning my skin. Are you still doing your eyebrows? Yeah, I because I pluck them, I get really like OCD about them because I'm like, they're so neat, they must be neat. In a hot minute. A hot minute. Queen of me so well. Ruby's the oldest person at our whole uni. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. Um, Ruby's gonna add an extra year onto her degree just so that um, she can live with us for another year. True friendship. <laughs> I just get too much FOMO. <laughs> oh, I forgot. This is the L. 16 hour camo concealer in the shade. Sorry, wait, is it Casey? So, this is the e.l.f. 16 hour camo concealer in the shade Love Sand. I was absolutely obsessed with the Makeup Revolution one for so long, but now I've tried that and honestly it's better. So, I highly recommend. I'm just using the Body Shop All in One Insta Blur to apply oh. my lids and face. I've never heard of her. Mm -mm. Is she good? I think so. <laughs> <laughs> I don't really notice, but then sometimes if I um, put it on my lids and then do my eyeshadow and then take my eyeshadow off because I don't like it, it takes forever to come off and I'm like, fuck me, why don't I put it on? I am um, actually my skincare routine today. <laughs> That's another fact about Ruby, she does never do that. She, she does, does never. never. <laughs> she never does her skincare, even though every day she's like, remind me to do my skincare before I go to bed. You never remind me. Ruby is also the most active person in my whole entire life. She'll go to placement for like 12 hours and then she comes home and is like, I'm off to the gym. <laughs> How? Mm. Like I've gone to two hours of class today and I'm tired. <laughs> and had like three naps. <laughs> Now I'm using the Laura Mercier translucent setting powder as always and I'm only going to put it under my eyes because I'm currently obsessed with putting on eyeshadow onto wet concealer. I feel like it blends so much better and it looks so much better. I'm using the Modern Renaissance palette today because... So we just texted us help. Oh. With. She says, our project is to make a British film that's recognisable to British audiences and my group is two Americans and a girl from Dubai and a girl from Kuwait. <laughs> and why is this coming out like purple? I probably like, never clean my brush. Mm, I was thinking that. I forgot what makeup I did. Um, did I oh, I did gold. What a win. I swear to God, if we don't win at Varsity, I'm going to cry. We will win at Varsity. Overall, I'm sure Surrey will win, but I just want to cheer team to win. Are you doing the same routine that you did for Compton? Yep. I mean, I mean like, <laughs> don't know what other routine you'd whip out. Um, so we had a competition on Sunday, and we came 17th out of 18 people. Um, the routine was actually really good, and we did it really well, and I was so happy with it, but it turns out like half of it was illegal, so that's why we lost. Um, I'm just using my Morphe palette, so the 350 and the 350B, I believe. I love it, it's excellent. I know, she's so pretty. Every time we go on the Morphe website, I'm like, I'm gonna buy it before they discontinue it, and then I never do. There's a good chance my camera is gonna die, um, so we're just gonna film as much as we can, and if it does die, then we'll come back at the end and show you what we did. <laughs> Not that we did. Oh, it. sneeze again. <laughs> I think I just filmed myself ejecting spit from my mouth. I just absolutely love this brush. <laughs> Twins! <laughs> Oh, another fun fact about Ruby is she's going on tour this year with Netball and I'm going with Cheer and we're staying in the same hotel and I'm so excited. It's going to be the best week of my life. We're going to heckle each other. We are. Well, I feel like Netball hate Cheer a lot and Cheer just don't really yeah. care. <laughs> I think Netball are just a bit more aggressive. Yeah. Oh no, I forgot to bake my smile lines and now they're creasing. If someone didn't understand makeup, they would be so confused by that comment. 
Ruby. Fun fact about Ruby, also she's vegan. She loves them animals. She loves that planet. I do. And she's always hungry. She is. Always hungry, she she's is. never not hungry. Although I'm actually not hungry right now and I haven't eaten anything yet. It's because you're just so anxious to be on my popping YouTube channel. I think what happens is like, because sometimes I like won't be hungry and then I'll be like, well, I'll eat because it's lunchtime and I'm bored. And then I'll like have like, I don't know, like one crisp and then I'm like, I'm ravenous and then I eat loads. But I'm like, if I had just not eaten in the first place, I would have been fine. And this girl goes through more peanut butter than anyone I know in the entire world. Her mum- You should have seen the rest of my family. Her mum is like a nutritionist. So she like buys all this healthy ass food and then gives it to Ruby. Ruby's cupboard is stocked full of like soy milk and- I'm actually low on peanut butter. Peanut butter. You're low? Her mum brought around like a crate <laughs> with like, tw like 10 jars of peanut butter. And she's gone through it all. I don't understand how like peanut allergies are still around. Like how didn't natural selection wipe that out? How has it come back? EpiPens and all that. Well, yeah, but like cavemen didn't have epipens. If they ate a peanut, they would just die. Like, did they eat peanuts? Where did peanuts come from? Trees, probably. I feel like they would have eaten them. Mm. Although, I guess some then parts of the world they don't grow peanuts. Or allergies. Yeah, but like. Yeah, like if someone had an anaphylactic shock back in the Victorian times. Yeah, they would just die. But I feel like some other allergies, like. Sun cream. I'm allergic to sun cream. Are you? Cavemen weren't knocking about with sun cream. Mm. And also, it wouldn't kill me. It's not that bad of an allergy. Maybe if you ate ingested it. Maybe. Should we try? <laughs> what are you trying to do here? Mm. Ruby is using the Kiko Milano Smart Cult Eyeshadow Palette. This mascara is £3.30 from Wilco. And it's the best mascara I've ever used in my life. It's the Essence Lash Princess False Lash Effect Mascara. Buy it. Essence, sponsor me. <laughs> oh, this is the BH Cosmetics <coughs> Shade and Define <laughs> Duo Brow Pencil in the shade Ebony. Oh. Are you gonna have lunch before you? Yeah, because otherwise I'll be so hungry. I don't compete until like 6 p.m. and it's currently 20 to 1. So I've got a long time. Now I'm using the Mislin Vitamin C Bronzing Contour Powder. It's the cutest little packaging ever. I love her. Look at you, where my beauty blinder? Okay. Are you having your hair curly? Yeah, I'm so excited. We always have to have our hair straight for competitions, but they let us have it curly for the last time. I'm so excited. But everyone's like, oh, I have to curl my hair, and I'm like, this is how I feel when I have to be on the coach at 3 a.m. with straight hair, and I have to straighten it. I've just used the Natural Collection blush in the shade Peach Melba. I've literally been buying this for like, Peachy. Well, I have this one, which is the old packaging in the same shade, which shows oh. how long I've been buying it for. <laughs> but this one's like completely cracked. Oh, we went to Aldi last night without Ruby because she fell asleep. But she did Snapchat as she was falling asleep, saying, "Oh, I've just got mascara on me." She Snapchat us saying, "Too tired for Aldi." So <laughs> I, I didn't was mean like, it. "Okay, she's too tired for Aldi." And then she fell asleep, and so we kept, were texting her, and we were like, um, "We're gonna go." Tell us if you want anything, and then she woke up and she was so grumpy. I really was. <laughs> to be fair, I think I would have been grumpy even if you hadn't gone to Ali without me. I just a bit of a mood. We're back. I've had a little outfit change. I put my uniform on before I do glitter because I think it's gonna go everywhere, and I didn't want to put my uniform on and get it all on the inside. That would be vile. Right, if you're ever wondering how to put in a cheer bow, this is how.
so I brush all my hair into the highest ponytail I can possibly muster up. Literally ridiculous, it gives me such a headache. And then I put my four fingers on my forehead and make sure that the ponytail is not further away than that. So it needs to be a bit higher. And then I tie it with a really thick hair band. As tight as I can. Gives you like a little mini facelift. Um, and then if my hair's straight, I back comb it, but it's obviously not straight today. So then I just take my bow, it has like a little hair band on the back, and I tie that around the ponytail. And then I take little bobby pins, and I do like at least two on each side. And I just pin down the tails and like cross it over the bobby pin so that it stays secure. Literally me at the start of this video and me now, I look like two different human beings. And that is that. And then just before I compete, I'll put on red lipstick, but I don't really like how I look at red lipstick, so I'm not gonna put that on until later. So that's everything for today. I know we missed a big chunk and we look a lot different than in the last <laughs> clip, but I will write down below all the products that we used. Um, yeah, we're ready for varsity. We're gonna have the best time. We're gonna win. It's gonna be really awkward if we don't, because I'm gonna up you, update you guys at the end of the video. But you have to do one of these little banners like, we didn't lose. Yeah. <laughs> um, I might try and get a little bit of vlog footage at varsity so that you guys can see it, and I'll put in a bit of my routine because I think I'm gonna make Ollie film it. <laughs> so we, we're, we made it to varsity. We're here. We're basically losing every score, but that's fine. This is Selby. Sarah! <laughs> I haven't competed yet, but um, I have to go in like half an hour to go and get ready. But it's a good day, it's a fun day, the weather's pretty good. It just keeps going like cold and then warm and then cold and then warm. But it's not warm enough to be warm, so that's kind of annoying. But yeah, it's really fun. And I will update you guys later. <laughs> for watching don't forget to like subscribe and leave me something nice in the comments and thank you to ruby for being in my video <laughs> all of her socials will be down below Ooh, okay. bye, bye. <laughs>